Ok, Assalamualaikum and selamat sejahtera. So, now let's proceed to formation of maltose. So, remember maltose is an example of disaccharide. Ok, so means that to form maltose, uh, it needs two monosaccharide. So, how it is formed? It is by the process that we call as condensation. So, that's why if you look at here, maltose is formed by condensation between two alpha glucose molecule. So, in specific, the monosaccharide involved to form maltose is alpha glucose. So, we need two alpha glucose to form maltose. And then, how the process is occur? So, a water molecule is lost or removed. Uh, so, Bila kita kata dia melibatkan proses condensation, so means that it will involve removal of water. So, where does the water is removed? From the OH group, OH is hydroxyl group, between carbon 1, this one, of 1 monosaccharide and also carbon 4, okay, of another monosaccharide. Saccharide. So, this is the first alpha glucose. This is the second alpha glucose. So, the water molecule will be removed here. Okay. And then a covalent bond is formed so that the remaining oxygen atom link carbon 1 and carbon 4. So, when process of condensation is already occur, uh, means that when the water molecule is already removed, okay, at carbon 1 and also carbon 4. So, what happened? A type of covalent bond will be Form. Uh, so, the COC linkage, this one, COC linkage is called glycosidic bond. Uh, so, you have to remember lah, okay. So, the process of condensation or the removal of water molecule, it will involve OH at carbon 1 of 1 alpha glucose and also OH at carbon 4 of the other alpha glucose. Okay, so let's say if the equation asks you to draw formation of uh, maltose. So, how to draw? Firstly, you draw the structure of alpha glucose here. Uh, yang ni ni macam yang saya explain tadi lah macam mana cara kita nak lukis alpha glucose. Alpha glucose means that OH must be located below the plane ring of carbon 1. Okay. And then plus, uh, sebab dia mesti melibatkan dua alpha glucose. So, lukis satu lagi structure of alpha glucose here. Okay. And then, since the formation of maltose uh, involve the removal of water because of what? It is by condensation. So, you have to show where does water molecule is removed. So, awak tarik lah OH daripada carbon 1 dan juga hydrogen daripada carbon 4 of the next alpha glucose. So, awak tunjukkan this one represent water molecule is removed. And then, you draw an arrow and then write here condensation. So, maksudnya ni menunjukkan bahawa proses condensation sudah berlaku. Okay, so what is the product? Okay, so if you look at here, awak lukislah macam tadi. Okay, the structure of alpha glucose. But remember, since water is already removed, okay, so dah tak ada lah OH dan juga OH dekat carbon 1 dan juga OH dekat carbon 4 di sini. So, dia akan jadi macam ni. Okay, uh, so the bond that join uh, this two alpha glucose here. So, this one we call as alpha 1, 4 glycosidic bond. Okay, why the name of this glycosidic bond is alpha 1, 4? Because of what? The monomers involved is alpha glucose. 1 is referred to the carbon 1 and also carbon 4. And then this bond we call as glycosidic bond. Okay, then how to write? Alpha 1, 4. Alpha, the sign of alpha and then dash 1, 4 glycosidic bond. Okay, so the whole structure here, uh, so yang kita panggil sebagai maltose and don't forget mass plus H2O. Why plus H2O? Because water molecule is already removed here. So, means that H2O is also one of the product. Then you have to label. This is alpha glucose. This is alpha glucose. The whole structure here is maltose and another one is water molecule. So, this is how you show and also explain the formation of maltose. Okay? okay so, now we proceed to breakdown of maltose. So, how maltose is breakdown? Okay, so maltose break into two monosaccharide molecules. So, means that bila berlaku proses breakdown of maltose, so what happen? Maltose will break into two alpha glucose molecule. So, how 
this process is occur by addition of water molecule. Okay, so this process, this reaction, when the water molecule is added to the reaction, this is called as hydrolysis. Okay, so if you look at here, actually a uh, breakdown of maltose, it is a reverse process of the formation of maltose. Uh, maksudnya macam mana kita nak lukis uh, Dia sama macam tadi lah Awak lukis dulu structure of maltose here Okay and then don't forget to label Alpha 1,4 glycosidic bond And then since this process is hydrolysis You have to show here plus water Okay and then draw an arrow And write hydrolysis So what is the product when uh, Breakdown of maltose is already occur So it will produce again to alpha glucose molecule Okay, so this is the first alpha glucose This is the second alpha glucose So that's why it is very important You have to know how to draw the structure of the alpha glucose Okay, so this is the process of breakdown of maltose Okay, thank you